Welcome back to The Breakfast Show, too. Today we have Dr. Isaac Lassell, the artistic director for the SIU International Guitar Festival, which is happening today and tomorrow. Good morning. So I hear this is the eighth year SIU has actually hosted this special festival. Can you share a little bit about why you all started this for anyone who may not be familiar with the event? Well, thank you for having me. Uh, we started this a few years ago, uh, basically as a way to give the students a feel of what's happening in the guitar field worldwide, uh, what things they need to prepare, what things they need to learn. So we have artists from all over the world meet up here in Carbondale, and during the day we have lectures for, the, for our students and our community, and that during night we have performances. So that, that's, that's how this came to be. Wow, that's incredible. I bet it's a great event. And so this year you guys chose to focus on guitar traditions from Brazil. Can you share why you guys chose to feature Brazil this year? Um, is I consider like uh, in the development of the guitar, uh, there are like four main legs. I would say Spain uh, or, and Italy where it starts. Uh, then the Brazilian tradition is really important. They've, they, they contributed to some of the most important uh, pieces and, and repertoire and pedagogy of the guitar so logically the advancement also in popular music of bossa nova samba so we wanted to have something that would expose students directly from the source to this so we have two wonderful artists Mosi Tejera Nieto uh, from Espirito Santo Brazil and Franco Galvão from Sao Paulo that both will be presenting and performing for us. Wow, and so then those two artists that you just mentioned, I'm assuming those are the two artists that are from Brazil that are coming over uh, to present. Yes, that, that, is, that is correct. Uh, Mr. Tejeda is focused on more on the classical side of Brazilian repertoire, and Mr. Galvão, he's gonna be presenting uh, brand new music uh, that by a composer from Brazil called Varico, which uh, over here in SIU, we curate his entire collection as well Mr. Teher is gonna be premiering, the world premiere of a piece for string orchestra and guitar by Italian composer, Italian-Brazilian composer, Marcos Vinicius. Oh, I bet that that's just going to be beautiful. So what are some of the events that you're really especially excited to host over these next couple of days? Um, basically, uh, if, if, you, if, if people go to our website, uh, music.siu.edu, and look on the festivals, we have the entire itinerary. But our main events are tonight that we're going to be presenting a series of pieces that have not been performed uh, before by Vadico, which was one of the pioneers of Brazilian popular music. And that's going to be by Mr. Franco Galvão. He arranged this whole thing for, for strings and guitar. And tomorrow, uh, we will have uh, Mr. Tejeda. So Mr. Galvan will be performing at the Guyon Auditorium at Morris Library at SIU. And Mr. Tejeda will be performing at the OBF Recital Hall. And so I know lots of people love music, especially the guitar. It's such a beautiful instrument. So if people do want to come out today or tomorrow, what time does it start today? What time do things get going? All events start at 7.30. Uh, we, was, we sell tickets uh, right at the door, so there's no need for pre-reservation. You just come right up and we'll take care of you. Well, that sounds like it's going to be a great time. Definitely a great festival to go to. I'm sure that people can't always say that they've seen artists from Brazil actually in person. Thank you so much for joining us this morning and talking to us a little bit about this International Guitar Festival. We'll be right back.